sometimes love just is not enough. Our Scream Free Therapist is giving us the next phase of phrases sure to tear couples apart. It's time for another edition of... Keeping a relationship together can be a lot of work, and knowing what to say or what not to say can be the key. So our Screen Free Therapist says there are five key phrases that can lead us down the path to destruction and five phrases that can kind of bring you home. Hal Runkle is here to help discuss the second of those two phrases that can break down and build up a relationship. Good morning, Hal. Good morning. We have to recap. First of all, tell us about the first phrase that can break you down. I told you so. I told you so. Four most destructive words how, of any relationship. How is that? Why well, is that? Well, it's because not only were you wrong, but you needed to have listened to me in the first place because I'm up here and you're down here and if you would just respect the wisdom that I have and so it's very damaging. So your relationship needs to be equal not Absolutely. one for okay the upper phrase the one to bring you back up tell me more. Tell me more you know I'm not going to assume that I know everything and I'm not going to just be satisfied with that I'm gonna say please tell me more tell okay. me more I wanna I want to hear what you have to say even, even if, if it's negative towards me. Even if you think you know what that person is going to say or exactly. should say exactly. just tell me more okay so this week we're talking about the next phrase that oh. can destroy your relationship and that is are you sure are you sure it's kind of related to the I told you so but it's before the the mistake gets happened it's saying you know are you sure because I heard what you said I don't believe what you said I think there's a better answer out there so I'm gonna ask that one more time to give you a chance to come around and say what I really think you should say. are you talking about an everyday phrases such as um, are you sure we should go do this or do that or buy this or, or buy when that? You, even something as simple as hey can I get you a cup of coffee are you sure are, no, and they say no are you sure which means I don't really think you meant no. I think you're playing a game with me, and so I'm going to ask it again in order to get you to say yes this time and make me look better. Okay. Instead, just take people at their word. Are you sure? No. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but sometimes it just kind of rolls off your tongue. And exactly. My husband may say, hey, can you bring me so-and-so? I'll go, okay, are you sure? Yeah. But I don't mean it in any bad way. But it just, just comes across as we're playing games here and we're dancing around language. It's amazing how much your life changes when you just start taking people at their word. Okay. Okay. So the phrase, the phrase to build me up is, ouch, that hurt. Exactly. It's Why? the one phrase, it's the one word that hardly gets said in relationships. Ouch, that yeah. hurts. Because it's a, it's admission of vulnerability. But if I really want to build an intimate relationship with someone, then I'm going to admit, you know what, there are things that you can do that can hurt me. And it's not a sign of weakness to say ouch. This is a sign of strength. Okay, so it depends on how you say it. You'd be like, ouch, that yeah, hurt. Exactly. That's that sarcastic. Not, okay. you're sure. And, so don't say and while there's a place for sarcasm, absolutely. But when you're saying genuinely ouch, and, and it's not, it doesn't have to be that exact word. It just has, you know what? You have the ability to hurt me. And what you said to hurt me. And, and yeah, that really, or you could say, you know, that really hurt my feelings. Exactly. I, I, I don't appreciate when you da da da. Exactly. Or I, you and I even, even do it with my kids because I'm wanting to build a relationship with my kids as okay. they're human beings, not just pets, you know, for me to raise. So well, they can sometimes say some things that really hurt. And so I get on their level and just say, hey, I just want you to know that really hurt my feelings. Well, thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Thank and you. you didn't hurt my feelings this week. Yeah. I appreciate it. <laughs> for more information on how screen for your posters, go to our website, dailybuzz.tv.